Hello? How are you? If you're anxious, that'll pass. It's the Medazolum. I'm sorry about this, but we've had so many security breaches, we were forced to take drastic action. And... Olivier is missing. He left for Chicago two days ago, but no one's seen him since. I know this seems excessive, but with our high-level security clearance, we have an obligation to our shareholders. Rest assured, we will compensate you when the hacker is found. So get some rest, okay? And if you're up to it, maybe capture some more footage? You're doing amazing work. I can't wait to show you the work we've been doing with your stuff. Take care. <laughs> so, they tossed you in the bunker. Nice. Those Templars upstairs aren't taking any chances. I think we need to erase all the dirt they might have on you. Did you hear that? <laughs> I think I just gave you level 3 security clearance! Now, head to the security room and use the cameras to watch the door to the server farm. Unfortunately, Melanie's in there now, so when I escort her out, that's when you make your move. I'd wipe these servers myself, but as the head of IT, I'd be a suspect. It has to be someone they've already locked up. Ah, oh, these Templars. They run our lives, you know. Ah, they decide elections, they control various capital markets, and they inject us with little microchips to track our movements and read our thoughts. It's all very scary. All right, listen, I'm entering the server room now. When you see us leave, get in there.
the dawn of the deadly 18th century. Rogues and sailors band together to live their lives by the sword. With no laws or morals, no gods and no fear. Only betrayal, mutiny, cruelty, and debauchery. There is plunder to be found on golden beaches. Will you risk life and soul to fight the pirates of nightmares? Benjamin Hornigold, Calico Jack, Charles Bain, and Blackbeard? spread thin, unfocused, like static and fog, lingering in networks and nodes, the nervous system of the world. Can you hear? Perhaps the temple was opened too soon, but this was not by choice. The cataclysm pushed all doubt aside. <sighs> we bless poor Desmond who gave his life so that you, the children of our labors, would live on to fulfill your purpose in ours, in mine. But now is not the time. My strength is not sufficient to inhabit an organic vessel. There is more work to do, more samples to acquire, more artifacts to find before my will can obtain. What's happening? Tell me! Make me whole again, my children. My instruments. Bring me forth to fulfill your purpose. Tell me! No, no, no! Something's wrong! God damn it! She should be here! Now! Living in that goddamned head of yours! Fuck, 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 fuck! Why did she spare you? Why are you still here? 